Some people think little girls should be seen and not heard, but I think... Oh, bondage up yours! My mother was a punk rock icon. People often ask me if she was a good mum. It's hard to know what to say. Do you think you're a rebel in today's society? Yeah, I suppose I am a bit. <laughs> Holly had her own ideas about everything. She didn't follow trends. She was a woman of colour in an industry full of white middle-class men. Nobody else was singing what Holly was singing about. I fell in love with her. I fell in love with the music. I actually started singing because of her. I must have been about four years old when I realised something wasn't right. The constant cycle of elation and despair. I remember her coming off stage and crying her eyes out. It seemed like she'd been through some trauma and music was a way of dealing with that. Everything else reflects everything else. Like the music reflects what's happening around you. People started saying she'd gone mad but she felt she was going through a spiritual awakening. I'm like an actress. On stage, I'm one thing, and off stage, I'm something else. I just consider myself as a person first. I went through a period where I rejected everything that my mum cared about. But now I find solace in retracing her footsteps. The world is playing catch-up with polystyrene, not the other way around. Drive away, drive away, drive away.